I found this outdoor pinwheel at the Dollar Tree and I'm going to start by taking my metal cutting shears and I'm going to cut off two pieces of the pinwheel and then I'm going to set that all aside. Next I have this pack of hearts. I got these from Hobby Lobby. I like that they don't have the holes in them. I'm going to be using four smaller hearts and two wood circles and I'm going to paint everything in some Wise Owl black paint. Now the wood circles I believe I got from Hobby Lobby as well. You can always use cardboard. I'm going to allow that to fully dry. Once dry I'm then going to take some Wise Owl Snow Owl and I'm just going to dry brush some white onto the hearts. Now I do not want full coverage. And now I'm going to glue my pieces together. I'm going to glue the circle at the top of where we cut the pinwheel off of its holder. And then I'm going to take the two hearts and place them on top of the other two pieces using hot glue to hold everything in place. Now you can see here that I'm making these cute little bumblebees using the Dollar Tree pinwheel. And you could change any colors or any shape of anything that you want. I have this brown paper wire that I found at Hobby Lobby. It's just wire that's wrapped in paper and I'm going to paint on top of it with some of the Wise Owl Black. Now I'm going to go back to my bumblebees and I'm just going to add a little bow to each bumblebee and I actually did make a third bee. And I added a different bow on the third one. I'm going to cut my wire into four pieces and I'm going to glue two onto the back side of the bumblebee's head. Once the hot glue dried, I then took a paintbrush and I'm just going to wrap the wire around the end of the paintbrush so that it coils a little bit. And I just think these are so cute. This was really the main part of my video. And from here, you could really decorate with them however you wish. I think a garland would be really cute. But I also found these three pieces at the Dollar Tree, these hexagon shapes. And I'm going to glue my B onto the shape. And then I have these word stickers that I found at my local dollar store. And I'm just going to glue the sticker to the bottom underneath the bumblebee here. So this first one says, be happy. We have be sweet. And the third one will say, be you. Now I do wish the background of these hexagon Wood pieces were white. You can certainly paint it. And then I'm just going to glue these three pieces together. And to finish this off, I'm just moving one of the hangers on the back side of the hexagon and I remove the other two. Add a little hot glue and there you go. Now we have this really easy, fun bumblebee decor. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Paint products, tissue paper, transfers, and mesh stencils can all be found on our webpage at chalkitupfancy.com. And don't forget, you can also check out other tutorials over on our webpage. Have a great day.